Thank you, Matt. New this morning. Hashtag yield is your shield. That's the message from the Georgia Department of Transportation right now for Lawrence County. That is where GDOT is planning a new roundabout, but Wanya Reese tells us why some people live near, living nearby are not too happy about it. Cars jet down Route 257 in Lawrence County. According to Kyle Collins with the Georgia Department of Transportation, more than 9,000 cars daily to be exact. Ken Rogers, who pastors New Bethel Baptist, says he thinks a roundabout will calm the traffic at the intersection near his church. But we're hopeful that it will help the traffic situation out here on 257. And uh, GDOT has said that they believe that it will. And, and Collins with GDOT agrees the project is going to improve safety at the intersection of Pine Hill and Waldrep Roads. It will be a roundabout project starting up. It's a joint effort between Georgia DOT and the county to enhance safety and also traffic operations at this intersection. Now, according to Kyle Collins with GDOT, once the roundabout is complete at this intersection right here, vehicles are going to have to slow down to 25 miles per hour. When the roundabout is completed, Collins says it will be large enough to handle trucks traveling from the Love's gas station up the road. The center apron, what we call a mountable apron, that is specifically designed for a dump truck, for a big 18-wheeler, if they have to make that big turn for them to mount up on it. And Collins says his office has received some backlash, but he has this message. Enhance that safety with a roundabout, which is an incredible safety mechanism. Um, we're going to do that, and we think folks are going to see the improvement here for sure. In Lawrence County, Wanya Reese, 13 WMAZ News. The project will cost $1.9 million, and the state and Lawrence County will share that cost. And now construction is expected to start by next summer and be finished by the summer of 2020.